and find a warning. Pull over or die. Hello, we're freelance police. And you're not. Ergo, we call the shots around here. Oh, why did you stop me? We're booking you, sorry hide, for indecent exposure. What are you talking about? I'm fully clothed. Except your face. Get a veil, please. Let's go, Max. Having that face is punishment enough. Hmm, no one seems to be breaking the law today. I know, what's the problem? Start committing some crimes, you sick bunch of reprobates. Greetings, anonymous motorist. If you were planning to bribe us, now would be the appropriate time. What's the charge? We're locking you up for worshipping false idols. What are you talking about? I never worshipped any idols. Yeah, tell it to the judge. Actually, why don't we show some uncharacteristic mercy and find someone else to pull over? Hello, sir, or madam. You're in big trouble, mister, or miss. For what? I'm sorry, I mistook you for a ferret. And as you know, ferrets are not permitted to drive in this state. But I'm not a ferret. Well, that's what it looks like from here. Come on, Max. Let's go find some other unsuspecting driver to accuse of made-up crimes. Take the wheel, little buddy. With pleasure. Please accept my condolences for your taillight. Sam 1, taillight 0. Pull over. This is not a test. This is an actual emergency. Hello. Know why we stopped you? No, why? Really? I was hoping you'd know. Seriously, why? Your taillight's busted. But you're the ones who broke it. Your point being... Hmm, what's the fine for a broken taillight? Why, isn't it $10,000? What? Are you crazy? Oh, uh, one moment. Allow me to confer with my legal counsel. <laughs> my attorney has advised me to pay the fine. Now, if you'll excuse us, we have some accounting to do. Thanks, sucker. Hey, Bosco. Hey, you just gonna leave him there? Uh... We wanna buy something. What do you got your eye on? We got your tear gas money right here. Really? All right, here you go. One tear gas grenade launcher. This is a salad shooter filled with onions. But it works. Trust me, trust me. Now put that away before someone gets hurt. 
What do you mean? The 10000 just covered the cost of materials, you know. Oh, I'm sure. It's okay, everybody. I'm all right. Look, Max, liver and onions are in town. I know! I can't wait! I love when they throw expired meat products at the crowd! Tampering with the mail is a federal offense, punishable by fine and imprisonment. As we found out after the incident with the garden hose. Ah, memories! You look like you could use some therapy! Not from a wide-eyed circus freak like you- Hey, it's another one of the soda poppers! Me? Right, you're, uh... Peepers! I don't know what you're talking about! My name is Sybil Pandemic, licensed psychotherapist! Are you sure your name is Sybil, not Peepers? Absolutely! Sybil Pandemic, licensed psychotherapist, that's me! He's trying to pull a fast one, Sam. Where's your gun? Violence is not the answer. Since when? Sam, we're dealing with a dangerously delusional psychotic here. Obviously. Sybil's normally a girl's name, isn't it? Must have been tough while you were growing up. Why do you think I became a licensed psychotherapist? Could we see your driver's license or some sort of ID, Sybil? My psychotherapy license is hanging over there on the wall. How about something with a picture on it, you obvious lunatic, you? I could draw one on there if it would put your mind at ease. Oddly, I don't think it would. You're a dead ringer for peepers from that old soda popper show. I get that a lot, but I'm civil pandemic licensed psychotherapist. Right. How about a little analysis? Certainly. Tell me what's bothering you. It's not me, it's Max. Hey! He thinks he's a rabbit. I am a rabbit! See? Yes, well, I would recommend Brady Culture's Ibo video for this situation. Good eye health helps combat delusions. I'm a rabbit! Ibo? Yes, my runny, poached, egg-like eyes could use a workout. You won't regret it! Who's this lady culture person? Brady! Brady culture! He's only the most insightful and amazing man on the planet, that's all! It's not Sean Penn? Not anymore! I'm so disillusioned. What's Hybro exactly? Ibo! It's called Ibo! It's a system of ocular exercises! So you can do push-ups with your eyes? Sort of. Just watch the video. Have you got a copy of this cockamamie video? I'm all out, but they probably still got a truckload or two over at Bosco's. Enough said. You're a dead ringer for peepers from that old soda popper show. I get that a lot, but I'm civil pandemic licensed psychotherapist. Right. Something else has been on my mind. Tell me what's bothering you. I've been feeling less frisky than usual. Well then, you might try Brady Culture's Ibo video. That'll put a spring in your step. Your eyes, too. Sounds like a piece of work. Oh, it is. It is. Something else has been on my mind. Tell me what's bothering you. Every time I watch television, I want to shoot something. That's quite normal, but you might want to try Brady Culture's Ibo video. It's very soothing compared to regular television. 
I'm beginning to sense a certain pattern to your courses of treatment. Well, you have to go with what works. Something else has been on my mind. Tell me what's bothering you! I think I'm hallucinating, because you look exactly like the former child star of a 70s TV show to me. How odd! Perhaps you should consider trying Brady Culture's Ibo video. It promotes ocular health and might help with the hallucinations. Is that your solution to everything? It's not mine, it's Brady Culture's. But it may very well be the solution to everything, yes. You're a dead ringer for peepers from that old soda popper show. I get that a lot, but I'm civil pandemic licensed psychotherapist. Right. Excuse me for a minute, would you? Sure! I can see you! Whoa! Where'd he go? Hey, there he is! You attacked a licensed psychotherapist? How could you? Just comes naturally, I guess. Interesting place. It seems familiar. I think I may have come in to get a tattoo of Bess Truman once when I was drunk. You don't have a tattoo. Maybe they used white ink. Do you hear a thumping sound? Probably just rats. Yeah, really big rats, locked in a closet. This guy's fast, and he's got good eyes, so I doubt I can sneak up on him. Take out his eyes, then! Thanks, you're a big help. Remember that time you had therapy? Yeah, the court will never make that mistake again. Be careful not to break anyone while we're here. No promises. I wish I had my banjo right now. And I wish I had a five-gallon tub of orange marshmallow peanuts. That could be dangerous. Yours, too. Let's look around. Great idea. What can you tell me about this Ibo videotape thing? Oh, it's marvelous! Changed my life! You should watch it as soon as you possibly can! Thank God! I've been locked in that closet so long I was starting to invent life stories for the mothballs! I've got to sit down. Oh my God! He's still here? Call a cop! You're in luck, ma'am. Sam and Max. We're freelance police. Civil Pandemic. Licensed Psychotherapist. Nice to know ya. Arrest that lunatic immediately! But he's my pal. You were friends with that overgrown sociopathic child? Oh, sorry. I thought you meant this overgrown sociopathic child. I thought psychotherapists didn't use words like lunatic. Really? Does it say that in the handbook? The psychotherapist's handbook or the lunatic's handbook? There's a difference? What's the charge? Assault! Kidnapping! Identity theft! Those are good charges. Some of my favorites! And what about Mopery? He locked me in the closet, and he's been pretending he's me! Gadzooks! Why? Well, these cases can be very complicated and delicate. There may be repressed feelings of inadequate transference, or latent unwarranted hypochondriac Freudianism. Come again? He's a complete whack job. Although, actually, now that I look closely, I think he's been hypnotized. Great thundering jellyfish on the squishy road to mayhem. Hypnosis. Yep, that's what I said. How can you tell? He looks so normal and lifelike. I'm a licensed psychotherapist. It takes a professional eye. Can we borrow your eye? We'll bring it back. Are there steps we can take? Soothing music, or perhaps some sort of invasive surgery? Shock treatment! Shock treatment! Typically, a hypnotic state can be revised after rendering the subject susceptible to new input. Sorry, I don't speak psychotherapist. You've got to knock them unconscious to bring them out of it. Knock them unconscious! Now you're talking! I can demonstrate on this guy if you'll knock him out for me. Consider it done! She's colorful enough as it is. 